So here we have Mr. Ratchet. Ratchet is seven and a half years old. He is a hound mix. Uh, he came to us as a stray uh, back in the springtime. Uh, he is a very sweet boy who loves his toys. He will do best in a home uh, as the only pet. Um, children should be 16 and up. Uh, Ratchet sometimes exhibits some guarding of his high value toys and treats. Um, but he, once he knows you, he is a very sweet guy. But he knows all of his basic commands and he really is just a sweet old boy. Um, he loves to go swimming as well, um, car rides, um, but really just wants somebody's attention that's going to love him. Um, and he may benefit from somebody coming a couple of times when you first meet him because he can be, um, he can take a little time to warm to you, uh, but once he knows you're okay, he'll be his best buddy, huh? Yeah, he's a good boy. He's a good boy. Hi everybody, this is Molly. She is a longtime resident here um, because Molly has very specific needs. She is just about five years old. Uh, she came to us a while back, originally from Mississippi. Uh, she has been through a few homes and we know something traumatic happens, we just don't know what. Um, she has a very severe case of stranger danger and it takes her a long time to warm up to people. But as you can see, once she does, she is an absolute love. She's a very smart dog. She knows all her basic commands. Molly would require several visits from someone that is interested in order to give her the time she needs to trust. You will not see the true Molly um, on the first couple of visits because her danger, stranger danger is so uh, severe. But we're slowly working on that with her. She is a great dog. She loves other dogs. And in fact, another dog in the home would probably be great for her. It would give her the confidence that she needs. Uh, no cats and definitely no children. Molly is very afraid of children and very afraid of sudden movements. Um, so a quiet, low foot traffic home is best for her. So if you'd like to meet our sweet Molly and have the right home setting for her and are willing to give her the chance that she needs, let us know. Come on. So here we have Jared and Credos. They're both six years old and they are a bonded pair, um, which means twice the love for you. Um, they do need to go home together. Uh, Jared and Credos um, came in very, very scared. Um, Jared has since opened up. He's seven whole pounds of dog right here. And Credos a little bit more fearful still. Um, and he's 17 pounds. Uh, they will need a home where they are the only children. No children, no only home. Uh, they do need a lot of work on socialization. Um, and also, they are not housebroken, so they're going to need somebody who can help them with that and is patient with that. They will use the wheelie pads, um, but they still need some help with that. So they're going to need a patient, um, quiet home. Um, to help them overcome their fears, especially um, Credo. Jared, not so much, but Credo doesn't quite know what to make of human touch. Um, he takes a while to warm up. Um, this guy, he doesn't mind it. Okay. Yeah, it's okay, boy. Credo, it's okay. Good job. Hi. Good boy. Good boy. Here we 
we have Miss Lola. And she is a bulldog true to her breed. Um, she's a very sweet girl, but very stubborn. Uh, so she's gonna require an owner we prefer with bulldog experience, um, who will let her know who's in charge. Uh, she does love her toys, but she's a super chewer, so um, you have to keep an eye on her. Um, unless you've got some real tough toys. She does love uh, toys stuffed with peanut butter too, as you can see. Um, Lola will need to be the only pet in the home uh, with no small children. It has to be an adult only home. Um, and again, she'll need somebody that will work with her uh, on her manners. Um, she can be protective over her things and her humans. Uh, so she just needs to be managed properly, but she's a big love. We've all fallen in love with her here at the shelter. Um, when she gets to know you, she just wants all the attention. Lola also loves to swim. She's not big on long walks. She prefers the shorter walks, and then she goes into her office and gets in her chair. Um, but she really is a great dog, and we're just hoping that the right person comes along soon. She really deserves a great home. She's been in a couple of homes already. Um, and that's why we're being so particular with her. We just want her to be in her forever home. She, she so deserves it. Um, there you go. There you go, love. Mm. Right.